What is up guys, Expert Win here, but you can call me Dominic and we are back here and we are yeah we are back here with WWE 2K19 Mike Remo and this video it is chapter two so let's get into it. If you like the first WWE and you wanna see some more, hit that like button and subscribe for more. Let's get into it. Alright. So last episode we were up here now let's we didn't talk to alexa bliss and baron blade so let's talk to baron blade you've worked with wwe in the past any last minute advice for me just make the most of your opportunity win or lose matt bloom brought you in here because he saw something in you just go out there and show him that again oh and try to get some free swag i'd like a bootios lunchbox if you're taking requests I kind of have, I kind of have bigger things on my mind than a video's lunchbox. What, like a replica title belt? Uh, Braun Strowman? Of course, just trying to keep the mood light. But if you do see a lunchbox lying around, I won't get it for you. Hey, I've seen some of your indie stuff online. Not bad. You're over reach the first three, uh, yeah, okay. But thanks, I appreciate you saying that. Thanks, any advice on facing Braun Strowman? How would you? Thanks, I watched you on TV every week too. I just can't believe how tiny you are in real life. I wanna say that one. Thanks, I appreciate you saying that. Oh, you thought I was serious? <laughs> time to watch nobody's like you especially nobody's who are going to get destroyed by braun Strowman. i thought we had a thing though <laughs> okay fine baron blade all he cares about is videos lunchbox and you want me to get destroyed <laughs> so let's go to our tryout match i'm gonna get demolished Expert winner versus Braun Strowman steel cage match. Let's do this. Oh. I forgot to do my thing, the changer. The following contest is a uh. steel cage match. Yeah, we get it. Dang it, I forgot to change it again. Hopefully next video we you will have remember it. remember Baron Blade? Apparently he trained this guy. Yeah, I can tell. Right, show Triple H you're serious by not leaving the steel cages against Braun Strowman. And this is a squash match. Let's get this boy. Oh no, he's already going for the f um, finisher. Can't even reverse this. Ah. Oh. Do we even bother to learn this guy's One, name? One, two, <laughs> we'll stick to his initials. three. D-O-A. D-O-A. Braun Strowman wins. You did a good job out there. Really? It feels like I got run over by a big bearded tank. I think it was enough for him to sign me? I don't know. But no matter what, you always have a home in the BCW. Thanks. Hey, I saw a lot of positive things from you tonight. Most importantly, you didn't seem intimidated by being on the bigger stage or by being locked in the cage with a monster. So with that being said, We'd like to offer you an NXT contract. Look that over and return it at tomorrow night's show. This is amazing. Thank you. I would shake your hand, but I think three of my fingers are dislocated. Don't worry about it. Rest up and we'll finalize everything tomorrow night. You did it. I'm shocked. Me too. I just can't believe it. I mean, against all odds. I know. I'll definitely be sad to see you go. You've become one of my top guys. 
You'll be fine, though, right? I mean, you got Cole and the rest of the crew, yeah? Sorry, what, what am I doing? This is your time to celebrate, not to worry about me and BCW. You enjoy the moment. I'm gonna go talk to Triple H about when you might start, so maybe I can get you on one more BCW show. We'll do a big farewell match. It'll be great. Sounds good. I... I'll see you back at the hotel. Congrats. I'm... I'm proud of you. Thanks, Baron. Couldn't have done it without you. Actually, I was literally just offered an NXT contract, and I can't wait to get started. You should just skip NXT and go straight to the main roster. Actually, you know what? Hey, Triple H, you say listen to your audience? Well, the audience is saying that I'm good enough to go straight to the main roster, which actually, I think I proved it tonight by going toe-to-toe -to -toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down. Uh, what the hell? What the hell just happened? I was about to say, that's probably not a good idea, but just got destroyed. <laughs> the next day. I proved it tonight by going toe to toe with Braun Strowman in a steel cage and not backing down, but. <laughs> <laughs> Less than 24 hours after we offer you the opportunity of a lifetime, you get into a fight with a fan outside a WWE event. I didn't get into a fight. And they attacked video. me. I'd really love to hear this explanation. He attacked me. What other thing do I need to explain? The fan attacked me. For I'm going to apologize. I am so... Sorry, I never intended for this to happen, and I can promise you it will never, never happen again. I didn't ask for an apology. I asked for an explanation. You need to understand, this isn't some rinky-dink independent promotion running shows at the Elks Lodge. This is a global company. We can't have our WWE superstars getting into fights with fans. It's unprofessional, and it will not be tolerated. On top of that, you were caught on camera bashing NXT, saying you were going straight to the main roster. I knew Who that in was the hell do you think you are? Look, I was just having fun with the fans, okay? I was just about to say that I would be happy to go to NXT, and then I was attacked. Oh, I bet. This is what I get for trying to do business with one of your guys, Baron. Come on, Hunter. Can't you just find him or something? No, I can't find him. If he's not on the active roster, I'm rescinding the contract offer. Leave or I will have security escort you out. Oh, dang it. I knew that wasn't a good idea. Bring me one of his guys again. Understood. This is on you, too. Remember what I said about making me regret my decision? Congratulations. You did it in record time. Hey, this wasn't your fault. I'm sure we'll figure something out. Now, come on, grab your stuff. We gotta go. I knew it wasn't a good idea. <sighs> Dang. Days later. Just a minute. Wakey, wakey, Jake the Snakey. <sighs> Jake the Snakey. It's too early for that to be funny. Sorry, I couldn't wait to tell you the good news. Triple H called and wants to offer me a contract again? No. Better. 
What could be better than that? <laughs> well, after news Excellent. of your NXT contract being pulled hit the internet, your fan fight video went viral. It's over 2 million views now. Sorry, make that 2.2 million. So a whole lot of people have watched me throw my career away. Why is that a good thing? Exactly. Because controversy creates cash. My phone's been blowing up. Everyone wants to book you now. You're the hottest thing on the indie scene. And based upon the principle of supply, there's only one of you. And demand, like I said, is high. Your rate is skyrocketing. Okay, okay, this could be good. It could be very good. We could turn chicken crap into chicken salad, if you know what I'm saying. I don't think I get it. Not You're anymore. gonna stick it to Triple H and WWE by making your own success in the indies. You'll be way bigger than you ever would have been in NXT or WWE, and we'll do it together. So what do you say? Are so you, you want me to be a Kenny Omega? I mean, what other choice do I have? I'm in. I'm in. Yeah, exactly. All Whatever right. choice do I have. Now, go brush your teeth. Your breath is terrible. Thanks, it's too early for this. Baron. It is too early. <laughs> oh, chapter two has been completed. Oh, well that was not much. So, for my ID, I'm going to do every chapter in a video. So, chapter three will be next. So, a, sing a single chapter will be in the thing. So, next video will be chapter three. So I think this will be a uh, what's it called? And then yes, the next week. All right, let's see what happens now. In my online business didn't go well. Well, NXT, I think, of me, not online business. Heading up in the bug van. <sighs> uh, somebody want to explain to me what's going on here? Give me a minute. Welcome to the new reality of BCW. Because of all your online hype, we sold out our usual allotment of tickets a few days ago. But since I'm an entrepreneurial genius, I pulled some strings with the school principal, allowing us to move the show outside. Therefore, doubling our capacity. <laughs> all right, all right, good work. But that's not all. See those fancy video cameras and that nice gentleman I was just speaking with? No. Uh, yeah. For the first time ever, BCW will be live streaming our event around the world on pay-per-view. So anyone who's not lucky enough to see Buzz in person can still watch him do his thing from the comfort of their homes for a small but fair fee. Isn't it great? Uh, Buzz. yeah, it's great. Question, who is Buzz? Oh, <laughs> that's your new nickname. You know, because of all the social media buzz you're generating. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. Buzz. <laughs> it's all turning into chicken salad, my friend. Uh, yeah. Speaking of making things not crappy, have you seen Cole? I feel like I should talk to him before our match tonight. Well, he's around here somewhere. And, oh, by the way, your match with him tonight is now Falls Count Anywhere. Thought you two could have some fun with all the extra space out here. <laughs> fun, yeah. You really have an odd definition of the word fun. <laughs> Will this match be a squash match again? Oh no. That's what I want to know. Uh, Cole, what are you wearing? We'll find out in the next video. Alright. So let's have a look around. I said there, there's a podcast on. Oh, new up to no good. We have no good. From inside the ring to behind the scenes, you're about to be up to no good with former WWE superstar Hood Benson and his co-host Pete Clark. Uh, all right, 
you know, Pete, I, I, I'm just saying, Pete, you can't get into a fight with a fan, no matter what the circumstances are. Oh, but Hood, the you know, fan it, attacked it, him it, first. What was he supposed it, to do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Look, 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 I, I, I get it. You know, it's, it's, it's a tough situation. I didn't even attack him. Crazy, you know? and, uh, yeah. and 30 years ago, I, I probably would have done much worse than this <laughs> yes, guy you did. Would. And, you know, uh -huh. I ended up in jail. Yeah. You know? My <laughs> but, 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 but he has to realize that WWE is the big leagues. Yeah, well, you know, well. this is not... This 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 is this is not in the garage, you know. This this is there's zero tolerance for that sort of thing. There's no ifs, ands, or, or buts about it. And then that that's why Triple H had no chance to but to pull this contract. No choice. Well, I would have liked to see him get a second chance. A, a second chance. Yeah. You know, he, he he ain't even had he he ain't even signed the contract yet for his first chance. All right. <laughs> you know, he, 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 yeah, I'm not listening to that one. His voice was the sound. Nah. Well, okay. Checking messages. Ah, it's that again. Same message, right? Message from July. Yeah. Um, settings. Video. No. Unlock. Unlock. Wait, why did I? Oh, I'm not meant to get anything unlocked. Chapter three. I am. All right. So, next video we'll have chapter three. So yes. And next episode we will find out what the hell is Cold Queen wearing? Is he trying to be the Black Panther? Where's your mask, mate? Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe if you want to see some more WWE 2K19 My Career Mode. Thank you guys for watching. Leave a like and subscribe for more. Peace.